There was a time when the Bobcats and Cougars met that people would be lined up four or five people deep around this soccer field. But not tonight. This is Calvin Castine. We're at Northeastern Clinton Central School for a big northern tier battle between the Northern Adirondack Bobcats and the Northeastern Clinton Central School Cougars. Jerry Kowalowski and Tom Lacey are the officials. The Cougars unbeaten on the year. Bobcats off to a slow start. They're at two and three. Not quite sure. I think their league record might be two and one or one and two. Cougars are three and oh in the league. Northeastern in Division Two this year. With the addition of Lake Placid, there's an extra soccer team, so they went to two divisions. But uh, three of the normal Division Two teams, Tupper Lake, Ticonderoga, and Mariah, do not have soccer teams. They have football teams. And their schools are not big enough to have uh, soccer teams also. So... That leaves three vacancies in Division Two, and the Cougars uh, filled up one of those vacancies. Normally, in the years past, without Lake Placid, the CVAC has been just one division. This is Ben Duty. Passes to Jeremy Ashline. Sent down the field. It's trapped momentarily by uh, Sean Burke. Cougars take it back. Jeremy Scott, the netminder for the Bobcats, and Mike Mickey Castine for the Cougars. There's a shot low and just wide. Wow, that was close. Zach Welch almost put it in. Where he received that ball, Castine would have had little chance of stopping it unless it were right at him. Sent down the field by Bryce Gadway. Southwick over to take the throw. Kicked by Burke. Richard for the Cougars. And challenged by Sheehan. Richard shoots it. Was off Scott, I believe. Sure looked like it was deflected off the fingertips of Scott, but apparently not. Nobody protesting the fact. It's uh, Lee LaValle, number two. And over on the far side, number seven, is Cassidy Patnode. Patnode will throw it in. Looking for LaValle. Jason Desrose there for the Cougars. Ball comes back. It's probably Tatro, five. No, Andrew Siskavich, five. There's Castine with the big punt. The green throw, Mark DeCost throws it in. Handball called. Justin Gardner will put it in play. Valley gives way for Patnode. Broken up by Desro. Thrown in by Sheehan. Welch tries to turn it. Ball comes back to Bilo. Sends it in. Picked up by Castine. Shut up! <laughs> <laughs> 
Deep. Headed. And grabbed by Scott. What was that there with the head for the Cougars? Lucas Dunn with the head. Almost beyond the grasp of Scott. White throw. No handball. Casey will throw it. This is Jarvis. And goes off the foot of DeCost. Southwick. Foul goes against the Bobcats. It's like Southwick putting it in play. A little high. Burt with the goal kick. Welch keeps it going. Looking for La Valley. <coughs> yeah, we got a card. Southwick gets a card. Or a delay a game. I'm going to give him the benefit of the doubt. It looked like he was just kicking it back. But he should have left it alone. <laughs> Scavage up to the 18, cleared back out. Uh, the Cougars, that was probably duty. Now Richard, headed by LaDuke, cut back by Burke, now Duty gives it to Ashline, passes back to Poisson, Welch intercepts it, Miller gets a foot on it, Welch, now Burke, oh he's taken off the ball by Dragoon. Cats will get the free kick. Gardner is it oh, deep in the box. Welch goes down. Last time gets the ball. Ball comes back to Welch. Still holding his head. Sheehan with a throw. Headed by Lavalley. There's a shot. Cast iron next initial stop. Ashline, no time to take prisoners, just clears it out. Throwing right back in. Duty is out of play. Thrown in by LaDuke. Now Siskavich. Woken up by Casey. Richard. Headed. By Dunn. Jarvis sends it through for Dunn. But it's broken up. For the Bobcats by Corey Bylaw. It'll be a corner kick for Dragoon. The sun behind him, not much wind, if any. Bilo stops it and clears it. Bilo just saved Scott's bacon. What do we got? Offside called. Gardner with the restart, comes to Welch, 
He sends it through a little too far. So Scavage can't quite catch up with it. Gastein says, you talking to me? Whoop, watch the elbow. Gardner. Up for LaValle. Passes wide. Pat Nold shoots it. It's going to be a throw for the Cougars. This is Desiro. Jarvis carries it. Up to Dunn. Ball deflects off Milo and goes to Scott. We're Twelve minutes into the game, still scoreless. Duty looking for Ashline. The green throw. Leduc. With a throw. Kept going by Welch. Ball comes back to Welch from Siskavich. Richard takes it away. Now Jarvis. Ashline sends it back in the middle. And get a number on that fellow. This is Welch. Carries it. Passes to the 18. Not a bad crowd. Good crowd, but nothing to compare with what the crowds looked like four or five years ago. Green throw. Stopped by Desiro. Saved by Adam Chipola, the backup goalie. Who's going who got the ball here? There it is. Goes a little shy and it's gonna be ball goes against the Bobcats. I'm not sure if it was Strack or somebody else. Ball went against the Bobcats. That's a green throw thrown in by Brian Trombley. Casey into duty. The front line headed out. I believe that Bilo, yeah, that was Bilo. Bilo. Looking for Strack, headed by Desiro. Now Casey kicks it. Green throw. Green throw. Thrown in by Trombley. Le Duke. No chance of catching up with that one. Pass on. Headed by Siskavich. Just time with the punt. Bobcats bring it right back. Taken away by Richard. 
Richard being challenged by Siskavich. Now Jarvis. Cats take it away again. Whipped by Carnes. Welch. And kicked back for the Cougars by Brad Miller. Green throw. This is Jarvis. Southwick sends it to the 18. Ooh, no dangerous. Quickly thrown in by Poisson. Handball. Miller will take it. Milo, Tierney. Tierney sends it. Last week I was up at the Olympic Stadium for the first game of the Mets Expos series and missed Tierney's uh, two goal game. I think he and Southwick each had two. You know, two players each had two and I know Tierney is one of them. And against Saranac. Scavage up for Strack. Tierney has it taken off his foot by Gardner. Cairns gets it back. Bylaw will throw. 21 and a half to go in a scoreless first half. Siskavich sends it through but wide. Castan gets a hand on it. Welch almost able to beat Castan. There's Tierney. Stopped by Bylaw. Ball wide for Tierney, headed by Bylaw. James Tierney with the throw into Jarvis. Sends it into the box. Welch. Let's see, 19, oh, 18, you do. Leduc with the ball. Siskavich to Welch who heads it. And it's still Strack over there. That's back by Sheehan. Now, head by Gardner. Temperature in the 70s today. It's still very mild out here, so a very pleasant evening for soccer. <laughs> Bobcat throw. Gardner. Miller sets it for Castine. Southwick sends it up. There's Dunn being challenged by Gardner. Scott makes the stop. Headed by Richard. Cairns, 
Now Cairns gets it again to Jarvis. Taken away by Gardner. Gardner sends it up to LaValle. Miller sends it back down for the Cougars. And Scott will pick it up. Nice punt. Into the into the backfield here. Miller will take the throw. No dangerous. <laughs> Welch. Welch, nice job, but he's down again. He wasn't in really position to shoot that. He should have passed that ball. Richard. Valley passing to Siskavich. Miller breaks it up. Burt knocks the ball down and the ball knocks Burt down. Valley gets the ball by Poisson. Poisson gets there first, kicks it out. Hi. Uh, Ball goes against the Cats. And I believe that was Sheehan. Fifteen forty-five to go in the half. Southwick being challenged by Burke. Gadway now sent down the field by DeCost. Bilo. Anybody use it? Scott rolls the ball out. Ryan, uh, Casey gets there first. Siskavich so kicked out. Miller over to take the throw. Siskavich. What do we got here? Sheehan. Pushing it ahead to Castine. The Valley almost able to catch up with it. Castine with the punt. Scott with the ball. We're approaching the 13 minute mark. Berger trying to switch fields, He's going to kick it out of play. Oh, 
Greensville. Welch sends it through. Miller clears it out. Scavage bearing down. Almost got the heel in his between his eyes. Jarvis battling Burke. There are tens over there. Gardner puts it back in play. Richard may have got away with going over the back there. And Scott makes the stop. Off Desero. Pat Noda with the throw. And ball. Back. Oh, the valley. Trying to deflect it. Hit it the wrong way. Pat Noda throws it back in. Richard jumps in front of the throw. Dale Hawksby thought his team was on a breakaway, even though his call went in his favor. He said, you took a break away from us. So he wasn't, I wasn't happy with the call. 10-20 left in the half. Ash line. Now uh, duty. Duty heads it again. Sent down the field by Miller. Tierney. Challenged by Bilo now. Jarvis. Bilo breaks it up. Southwick over for the corner kick. Back in by Poisson. Elbow by Welch. Miller will take the free kick. Stopped by Burke. Miller sends it right back, headed by Ashline, broken up by Gardner. Welch in Desero. Welch brings it back. Leduc shot headed out by Poisson. Welch will take the corner kick. A little long on the kick. That node gives chase. Decost headed by Lavalley, but right to Castine. Burke sends it down the field. Stopped by Desero. The valley grabs the seat. Oh, into Tierney. 
Tierney over to Jarvis. Jarvis gets the ball to Casey. Pat Note over to break it up. Casey gets the ball back. This is LaValle. Trip called on Poisson. Under six minutes. Left and a half. Gardner. He'll put it on net. A little too much. Castine will take the throw. Pushing called and Sheehan. White kick, 4.47 on the clock. Bilo and Duty. And the Hoyt throw. Best throw quickly in to Casey. Off Pat Node. In the back. Headed by Poisson. Keeps the ball in play. Gets it to Tierney. But it's broken up by Gardner. Duty throws into Jarvis. Line Good. off Tierney. Three and a half minutes to go. Scoreless first half. Northeastern 5 0 on the season. Bobcats 2 and 3. Not to throw their records out the window when these two teams meet. Bilo. Green charge, Miller is hit in the midsection. He is double over in extreme discomfort. Miller is able to walk off under his own volition. And the Cougar Choir picks up a new soprano. Connor replaces Miller. Southwick will put the ball in play. 240 on the clock. Apparently went off Pat Node. Obviously should have let that one go. Southwick will take the corner kick. Push on Richard. Little trash talking there looked like from Siskevich. Offside, Siskevich. O'Connor will put it in play. They come by plane, by train. They come by all means of transportation to get here, including stroller. Whoa, welch. This 
Southwick. Down to 38 seconds in the half. These players better let the refs call the game. <laughs> They're all a little too touchy out there, I think. Scott makes the stop. First half is going to come to an end. In a scoreless tie, Northeastern being visited by Northern Adirondack. Stick around. Second half coming right up. I can only remember seeing this one other time, but it's one of those rare two moon days. There are two moons out tonight. This has only happened uh, once before that I can recall. This is where we get that old saying, once in a two moon. Second half is going to start with they fired up Bobcats and a scoreless tie for the unbeaten Cougars. Bobcats will kick off Scavage and Sheehan. Welch comes deep. Southwick Markson. Green direct call. Fraction happened over here, I guess. Offsides called. Cast iron will handle the restart. Duty. Cougar fans wanted that little elbow from Gardner called. I know Gerald Roberts is sitting there saying, what elbow, what elbow? Burke will put it back in play. A little push from behind here by uh, Duty. Miller seems to have recovered from his first half injury. Casey, uh, I mean, Casey Richard, that is. Bilo throws it into Burke. Poisson heads it. Testine with the punt. Sent through by Welch, right to Castine. I lazy fly ball. Richard gets a head on it. Done. I bounce at the 18. Scott is there. Right at the limit of the penalty area. Plus on a little throw. Broken up by Casey, taken back 
by Sheehan. Pat Node gets a foot on it. Pat Node gets it to the speedy Welch. Welch off Castine's knee. Welch will take the corner kick. And a little deep into the high bounce. Headed out by Desero. Desero kept it out of the net. Duty throws it in to Ashline. Ashline sends it through. Burt takes the goal kick. Headed down by a Casey. Stays in. That was Dikos. Now Dikos throws it in. Bicycle kick from Welch. Sends it into the penalty area. Hestein is there. He gets a little bump from Lavalley. Southwick. Green throw. Dikos with the throw. Welch calmly heads it to Pat Node. Pat Node keeps it going to Welch. Challenge now by Desero. Welch turns and shoots off cast line to be a corner kick. Welch again will take the corner kick. Pat Node sends it back in. Headed by Miller. Now Gardner. Gardner with the left foot. Right on net, right to Castine. Another Cougar Bobcat battle. Those of you who didn't, uh, didn't come to the game, you're missing a good one. Well, actually, you're watching a good one, but you missed it in person. Casey throws it in to Southwick. Nice, oh, almost a nice move taken away by Decost. Sent down the field by Siskavich. Castine calls for it. Comes out to the 18 to grab it. Castine goes to the wing. Ball bound. Goes over Leduc's head to Ashline. Ashline intercepted by Bilo. Here's Pat Node. Up to Welch. Welch has Suscavich on the wing. Kept it too long. Kept it too long. Suscavich was wide open on the wing. Southwick rattles it off Burt. Now Casey tries to keep it going. Done. Up to Jarvis. Jarvis comes wide to duty. A pair of 13s will be off Gardner. Uh, apparently off duty. Richard. Uh, Casey. Back to the 18. Ball squirts through and picked up by Scott. Scott throws it up the wing. Poisson runs in to <laughs> Malton. Don Malton says, where was the call? Poisson running into the valley. There's Dunn. Miller, deep into the box. Scott will play it in the air. Six seconds to get rid of it. <laughs> 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 I 
Sheehan. Intended for Leduc. Poisson gets there. Uh, Leduc will throw it in. Siskavich intercepted by Miller. Dikos throws the ball down to Welch. Welch with a low shot. Miller stops it, sends it back out to the A team. Gardner takes it off Dunn's foot. Duty will throw it in. Under 30, 29, 20 left in the second half in a scoreless ballgame. Poisson with a throw. Siskavich. High bouncer. Headed by Welch. Miller calmly kicks it out. Pat Mill throws it back in toward Siskavich. It goes out off Desero. Oh my God. There's a corner kick. Another corner kick for the Cats. This one is low. Welch blocked. Dikos gets there, gives it back to Welch. Headed out by Poisson. Back to Burke, sends it right back in. Over Castine's head, he recovers and grabs it. Green throw. Nacho spike. Last time with the punt. Headed by Bilo. Ooh. Jarvis, a little elbow. And Siskavich repays the favor. Miller tries to carry it out. Pat Mill sends it back in. Castine will take the goal kick. Up for Southwick. Jarvis up the wing for Southwick. Southwick shoots it toward the net. Scott with the punt. Headed by Siskavich. Fifteen minutes into the second half, and we're still scoreless. Ashline sends it deep right to Scott. Uh, 
Nice punt from Scott. Headed back in by Gadway. Done. Try, gets there, keeps it going. Taken away by Bilo. Jarvis. Now Welch sends it down the field. Fosson gets there, clears it out. Green throw. There's Gardner. Welch shoots it in. Welch puts it behind Castine. While he's acting silly, we'll put, to take the camera off him. We don't tape silly, sir. <laughs> you want to come out and act <laughs> like this? We'll, we'll shoot you. We'll just come out like an airplane. We'll or take your shirt off or anything like that. We'll uh, we'll look elsewhere. But Welch, what a burst of speed! Put it behind Castine for a one nothing Bobcat lead. Twenty-three, twenty-one. Oh, Burt takes uh, Dunn down. This uh, strategy tonight for the Cats is play defense and hope for something on the front line, and that's what happened here. Welch, a great offensive weapon in the in the uh, Bobcat arsenal. Well, Bobcats have been playing solid defense back here. And hoping that Welch and the rest of the front line could use some speed to get some scoring. And that's what happened here. And that's, that's the way the Bobcats played for years. Don't let the other team score. And uh, it's working for them tonight. Don't let the other team score. And uh, so far, they have not let the Cougars score. Welch sends it through. Miller's there to break it up. Welch gets the ball. Chips it toward Castine on the back of the net. 21 something to go. Says Jarvis. Sends it through for Cairns. Broken up by Gardner. Dragoon will throw it in. Oh my God. Welch controls down the wing, down the wing, into the penalty area. Gadway, uh, yeah, Gadway and Dragoon take it away. Welch gets it back, sends it weakly toward the net. They're almost halfway through the second half with the Bobcats leading the Cougars one to nothing. This time with a good punt, it's stopped by Decost. So Scavage gives it to Sheehan and over on the far side, we've got Brian Trombley, number four. Trombley will throw it in. Headed by Poisson. Trombley will throw it in. Here's Sheehan passing back to Bilo. 
off Tierney. Leduc will throw it in. Nope, check that. Trombley throws it in. Northeastern, 5-0. and oh. Unbeaten in the 2002 season. Bobcats at 2-3, and three, looking to even their overall record. Division two rivals in soccer. Gadway gets it to Dunn, broken up by uh, DeCost. Here's Welch. Cairns will take the throw. Jarvis will send it. Done. Beats Burke to the ball. Gets the ball by Burke. Burke gets the ball back. It's off Dunn. A green throw. Like Bob Daly arriving a little late. There's some of the crowd. We haven't really shown much of the crowd tonight. Whatever the call was that went against the Cougars, Gardner puts it in play. Nice kick by Gardner. At, at the feet of who's number nine here, Strack. Plus on with the throw. Duty sent back. Burke sends it up. Richard controls. Trombley gets the ball for the Cats. Now Strack sends it. Trombley throws it in. Cats have the Cougars playing on their heels. Dikos up to the 18. Welch gets there. Keeps the ball in play. Left puts it out in front. And here's Sheehan with a shot. And short hops Castine. Richard. Uh, Tierney tries to send it down, but it's broken up by Bylaw. Here's a shot by Ash Lyon. Ball put back in play with a goal kick. Jarvis tries to keep it going. Scavitz with the head. Now here's Jarvis with a shot. It's deflected by Scott. Robbie John Dragoon will take the corner. Knocked down, Cougars looking for a call. Bodies flying everywhere. Sent back in, it's going to be wide, it'll be a goal kick. 13 20 remaining in regulation. 1 nothing. Northern Adirondack leading Northeastern. Casey sends it to Dragoon. Now 
and Bilo pass intercepted by Duty. Cougars are now taking more shots from beyond the 18. That's kind of what they've got to do. And all the fans in these first four or five rows and these this bleacher, first bleacher, they've seen about 3% of the game. But they're here supporting their school and enjoying each other's company but not really watching the game. And I think there's absolutely nothing wrong with that than just pointing it out. Miller, a good thrower, throws it. It's gonna be headed, punched out by Scott. Desro tries to send it back in now. Ashline. Dikos right on top of Ashline. Ashline couldn't get a good shot off. Jarvis trying to push his way through Siskavich. Casey up to the 18, headed by Burt. Bilo will take the throw. Oh, Strat and Busson colliding. Eleven oh two left in the second half. Off Jarvis. <laughs> Bilo throws it in. Burke sends it back. There's that speedy Welch. Dragon trying to get the ball. Sent down by Leduc. Ten minutes remaining. One nothing Cats lead. Castine puts it in play with the goal kick. Intercepted by Gardner. Sent back by Richard. Off Gardner's foot. Jarvis. Sends it up to the 18. Southwick charging in and Scott makes the stop. She gets a little pep talk from Sean A trip on Southwick. Justin Gardner taking his time. I make sure my socks are up. Make sure my trousers are okay. Let's oh, let's see here. Oh, that took at least 20 seconds. Using the clock. Welch gets a foot in there. It'll be a goal kick. 8.27, Cats uh, will substitute often now, use that clock, we got Lavalley back in, replace the track. Decost will take the throw, 8 minutes to go, Southwick with a high kick, Burke. Can't get a body on it. And finally gets a foot on it. Lavalley and Jarvis jockeying. Excuse me, and uh, Duty. Duty gets, sends it down. Uh, Burt goes by and shot is high and over the top. Oh, I don't want to know. Goody. Goody. Uh, Goody. Gardner. 
Gardner puts it back in. Here's Jarvis. Southwick battling the Duke. Here's Siskavich. <laughs> Casey kicks it, but <laughs> not really on purpose. 646. There's Desero. Off green, the white throw. <laughs> Welch takes it back, gets the ball by Desero. Puts it in front of the net. Back near the 18, Pat Nod miss kicks. Sheehan and Richard going after it. It's going to be off Sheehan. against the scavage. 556 remaining. Ball comes to Burke. Gets rid of it. Sent back by Poisson. Richard has help. Passes back to Death Row, but Welch is in the area. And Welch off the fingers of Castine. against Lavalley, I think, or what is it there? Whatever it is, it's using up a lot of time. It's no, no call against Lavalley. It's uh, off Lavalley. It'd be green throw. Gardner sends it back in. La Valley and Poisson. Green throw. He'll leave it for Sheehan. 432 and ticking. Dunn catches up with it. Broken up by Bilo. Corey Bilo hustling back. Broke it up. The white throw. There's Miller over to throw it in. Does the flip. Kicked out. Poisson's there. Sends it up to Miller. Ball was out before Miller could kick it. 3.20 left in the second half. 1-0. Bobcats looking for the upset win against the Cougars. Ashline battling the Duke off the Duke. Southwick will take this throw. Nice throw headed out by Burke. Headed back in by Desero. Off Southwick will be green throw. The Duke to Welch who heads it. Look out. Call one against the scabbage. Richard puts it in the air. Handball on the Bobcats. 2 10 left in the second half. Cougars with a chance here. Golden opportunity. Just outside the circle at the 18 yard line. 
Southwick will shoot it. One forty-five to go. Richard gives way for Jarvis. That node can't quite get control. Jarvis sends it off Bilo. Duty throws it in. Siskavich out to Pat Node. 109 left. Bilo. White throw. Miller over to take it. Into Richard. Richard chips it out, not even in the vicinity. 44 seconds. Bobcats in no particular hurry. Gardner will put it in play. Ashline. Sent down the field by Decos. Mike Castine comes out with the body. Sends it down. 28 seconds. 20 seconds. Now Castine out of the net. Pat Note has the ball. 12 seconds. Taken away. Headed by Bilo. Four seconds. The Northern Adirondack Bobcats have defeated the Northeastern Clinton Central School Cougars. Their record goes to three and three. And uh, they couldn't be any happier if it was six and oh right now. They're, they have beat the Cougars in a year that the Cougars are expected to dominate them. So a one to nothing win. The Bobcats game plan of don't let the other team score comes through in this one and they take the one to nothing victory and that's the way it was on this Tuesday the 17th day of September 2002 you've been watching hometown cable win or lose TV worth supporting and we got an injured player here for the cats to end the ball game thanks for watching and for those of you supporting hometown cables ongoing efforts